All parties in the matter of De Leon versus La Pata. Step forward. Leticia De Leon is suing her former friend, Amy La Pata, for an unpaid loan to start a home health care business. Ms. De Leon, you claim that you made either an investment or a loan to the defendant for a business. I'm not exactly sure what you're alleging. You didn't get money back and you want your money back. The defendant says that you invested in a business that didn't go anywhere. So why don't you tell me first how you know Miss Lapata? My friend worked with her and I know that she is the owner of the Anaheim Care Provider, so I trust her. Is that what you have, Anaheim Care Providing Service? Yes, Your Honor. If I looked it up in the phone book, would you have a phone number? Yes, Your Honor. Okay, and how long have you had it? I started um, November 18, 2011. And when did Miss DeLeon give you money? That was December um, 2012. And she gave you money as what? Investment money, Your Honor. Good. And you invested it in your business? Yes, Your Honor. What did you buy? Printing the brochures and then Printing business brochures. card. Okay. And then do uh, some marketing. Okay, and that's how you've made your money over the last three years? Yes, Your Honor. Good. Now, what did you do with Ms. DeLeon's money? How was she supposed to get it back? She invested the money that it didn't work out. At the Why end didn't it work the... out? It worked out for you. It didn't work out the business, Your Honor. It went down. Well, you just told me that you have a business. You started a business in November of 2011. She gave you money in December of 2012. You're still in that business. It has a phone number. That's how you make money. What do you mean the business went down? The business went down that was starting 2013, Your Honor. What kind of business was that? It's a caregiving It's services. the same business you're in now. Yes, I'm a caregiver, Your it's Honor. It's the same business you're in now. Did you just change the name? No, it went down the business, Your Honor. I don't understand what you mean. You mean it went away or what was the name of the company in December of 2012? Anaheim Care Providers, Your so Honor. So it's the same company that you have now. I don't have the company now, Your Honor. When did you lose the company? Starting 2013, Your Honor, it didn't materialize because I couldn't get any clients. I thought you said you still have a phone number. Uh, no, I don't, have a, I don't have the phone number anymore, Your Honor. You told me two seconds ago that you did. Are we not understanding each other? Is there oh, a I'm language barrier? I mean, I, I'm serious with you. Now, if I were to call information and ask for Anaheim Healthcare Provider, would they give me a phone number? No, Your Honor. Have you tried to contact her at that number? Yes, Your Honor. I have the telephone number of that Anaheim Care Provider. Oh, okay. She says she has this phone number. I'm going to go back there. I should not be able to reach anybody, right? Yes, Your Honor. Who are you? Russ Nybert, Your Honor. How are you related to her? When Amy first started her business back in 2012. Yeah. When, a when Amy first started her business back in 2012, I do marketing and, and consulting and whatnot, and she came to me and asked me to help her do some marketing to bring clients in. Just a second, what do you know about this case? Anything or nothing? That her business is shut down. I never got paid a dime out of her business for doing the marketing I did. Did you file tax returns last year, Ms. Lapata? Yes, Your Honor. And who did you list as your employer? I'm a self-employed, Your Honor. So you were self-employed? Yes, Your Honor. How many people work for you? None, Your Honor. So you just do home health care yourself now? Yes. 